Um, Charles Gregory is the CEO of Digital Marketing Consultant. Uh, he's an international speaker, a fellow producer from last year's Freedom Summit uh, Global Season 1. We really had an amazing time at the Magic Central uh, in KL. So really, really uh, blessed to be a partnered with Charles. Uh, he has a 15 years experience in the digital marketing, um, an entrepreneur specializing in the digital marketing training and strategies. He consulted over 500 companies of all sizes and trained over 3,000 students in Malaysia. He runs one. He runs one of the largest digital marketing school in Malaysia and developed 20 digital marketing courses and also received multiple awards, uh, um, SME 100 and SCBA, SC, SCBA awards. Charles is currently the president of the Digital Marketing Association of Malaysia. So without further ado, I would like to introduce you to my partner and uh, my mentor and a very, very, very dear friend, Charles Gregory of Malaysia. Hi, Charles. <laughs> hi, hi. <laughs> hi, everyone. I'm too sexy, little bit, yeah. <laughs> okay. Hi, everyone. Uh, thank you for the kind introduction, Celia. Uh, that's, that's amazing. I just want to appreciate you uh, being the founder and are doing this for everybody. I'm back again, and this time I'm going to share on uh, SEO skills. Yeah, so I don't want to waste time, so let's get started. I want to share my screen. Give me a minute. Hmm. Okay. Give me a minute. I'm just going to share my screen here. All right. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to share on how to build your empire with SEO, and I'm going to do it very with a very practical strategy. So I will be browsing or tabbing a few multiple tabs so that you know um, how to see things um, you know, the way it is, yeah, rather than just theory. So this is what I'm going to do, because I like to share with you more on the practicality of doing things rather than just theories here. Yeah? So why and who is this for? Definitely it's for people who want to build income, uh, multiple stream income using uh, SEO or search engine optimization. And why do I like this? Simply because one skill set, if you invest in this, in, I mean, there's so many skill sets in digital marketing, so many skill sets in anything that you do. But if you just want to focus on SEO, I think it's going to build you multiple streams of income, giving you more freedom and more time also. So again, yeah, when I was traveling in the Philippines earlier, I actually you know, put my footprint everywhere I go. And since this is uh, Freedom Summit is from uh, Philippines, I went there. And if you can Google together with me, the most handsome man in Cebu, uh, you'll probably see like uh, Enric Gill, Mathieu, Richard, Paul. And also at the bottom a little bit, you will probably see um, this guy. Yeah? Hold on. There we go. Most handsome man in Cebu, a little bit bottom, you will see Charles Gregory there. So I went there on June 7, 2019. And you can see there, yeah, definitely. I mean, if you don't believe me, which you shouldn't, just Google it because, like I said, everything will be proof and be shown live to you. So please type in on your own, most handsome man in Cebu. And then if you're not happy or you're not convinced enough, I also went to Paranaki. Did I pronounce it correctly? If you can just type in the most handsome man in Paranaki, uh, Paranak, Par Paranaki, uh, please forgive me if I pronounce it uh, wrong. Yeah? And you can also see that I'm there. Uh, that guy look like me or I look like that guy. Either way, it's the same. Yeah? We look like each other. Um, go, go live. Yeah? You can see that. Yeah? And of course, and of course, the legendary uh, in Malaysia, most handsome man in Malaysia, you type in, you will see me. So did I make any money from this? No, I did not make a single cent. And that's the truth. And I just do it for fun just to let you know that you can do anything with Google if you want to and if you can. But right now, what I'm going to share with you is I'm going to go back to my slides a little bit. Why do I like SEO? Simply because it is science and it is data. It is not something that 
um, I know, you know, what if, what if, what if, it is more towards strategy steps. What do I mean by that? If you take the action, you take the steps, you will see results. And the results will differ whether you earn X amount of money or XX amount of money or XXX amount of money. And it's a beautiful business simply because a skill set that you can build, you can earn, you can flip, and you can then scale. So it's up, up, up to you because, you know, and, and this is recession proof. Whether it's COVID virus, whether it's SARS virus, whether it's recession, you know, unless you tell me that Google shuts down and there's no more internet in the world, then probably it works, yeah? But other than that, I do believe that this is amazingly, amazingly good. And this skill, just to share with you, even though many people talk about it, but many people don't do it. Um, simply because it's, not to say it's difficult, it's just simply because it takes a little bit more effort to learn compared to Facebook or, you know, a little bit more difficult, yeah? So let's go. So that's why I mentioned in SEO, we, we cover a lot of things, uh, but I don't want to overcomplicate things. So I was going to go into the very, very basic on how you can get started. Basically, in SEO, you need to cover only four things. And these four things, uh, you can do it immediately uh, by learning, yeah? Immediately, you can see results within three to six months. So the first thing you need to know it is to identify how people are searching for you. We call it the topic or the uh, niche or the keyword research. Yeah? This is important because most businesses or most individuals, they rank for keywords that is not relevant. Like the most handsome man in Cebu or the most handsome man in Malaysia. I admit it's not relevant. It's just for fun. But if you really want to make money from it, you need to rank keywords that, you know what I'm going to say? Um, that people are searching for because when people go on Google, when people go on Google, they when people use Google, yeah, they only have probably three intentions. And this is probably you and I, no matter where you are in the world, you probably use the same thing. Number one, you're looking for information. Sure, you're looking to type something like, you know, who's the most sensitive man in Africa? Maybe in the future, I'll do that. It doesn't matter, yeah. Uh, information, yeah. Second, you're looking for navigation. When you want to eat something, or like you know, if you're in seafood or you want to eat, um, you know, um, jolly jolly beans or whatever, you know, jolly bees, yeah, uh, it doesn't matter. Yeah, you Google for navigation. You know, use your ways, or you get a map or Google Map. You Google for navigation. So these two, I'm not so concerned. The third one, which I don't want to show my middle finger, yeah, the third one. <laughs> I mean, the, the third one. Uh, it's more towards. Sorry, third one. It is more towards the buying intent. When you Google something, you want to buy something, correct or not? And if you think about it, every single businesses, we have to promote, we have to market, we have to advertise. But when it comes to Google, when you type in something, you are already interested in that particular product or the services. And when you see, you let me know, you let me know, yeah? you let me know. When you go and type in, in Google, when you want to buy something, do you go on the first page, second page, or third page? Most people, most people, I would say, will go usually on the first page and that's it. I mean, uh, I'm not looking at the comments because I want to focus on you. And I'm sure that, um, you know, it will be on the first page. That's it. Yeah? So that is how you need to identify how people are searching because the intent to buy, it's very easy. So if you have a business and you know what people are looking for and you match them together and you're on the first position of Google, you will make money. That's it. It's a beautiful, simple process. But it takes a lot of work. Simple, but it takes a lot of work. So the first part is to know keywords. We shall cover this today because I do have about half an hour with you. I will cover the first part. The second part, how to structure your website. You, you write it down. You take it down. Yeah? Because you can learn on your own if you want to. You can just go to Google. You can search for it. As long as you know how to Google it, you know what to do. You can go to YouTube. How to structure your website for SEO. Learn this skill set. Then after you learn how to structure your website, you need to buy a domain, hosting, you know, the simple basic. It's not expensive. About 200, 200 ringgit, which is about 40 to 50 USD, you can get a website set up yeah, on your own. So after that, you need to learn how to build your website. I will suggest you use WordPress, um, not Shopify, not SiteGiant, not uh, Wix, not you know all those famous, simply because WordPress, one of it is free. Second is because it's open source. And the third, which is more important, and the most important, is on the first page of Google, according to my research, Basically, technically, there are more than 60% are on WordPress platform. 
So if you know they're on WordPress platform, why not learn it? And WordPress, it's free to learn. It's the free to use, and it's quite simple. If you know how to use, uh, for example, maybe Google Document or Document, where you click and drag, insert image, you know, edit text, you will be able to learn WordPress. So if you are a basic beginner, I'll probably think that within 48 hours, you'll be able to learn how to set up a website if you want to. So go and learn. Yeah? And this is the little bit of technical part, but on the fourth part, Topic research, structuring a website, building a website, and then after that, off-page SEO where you need to build backlinks. So technically, technically, it's very common, it's very simple to understand SEO. It's not complicated. It's like running a business offline. Does that make sense to you? Offline. Yeah. So in order, the most let me before I go into that, can you share with me the most powerful marketing in the world? It is definitely not Google, it's definitely not Facebook, it's definitely not. TikTok, definitely, definitely. Yeah, the most powerful marketing in the world is word of mouth marketing. Hey, um, Celia, what's the best place to eat? And Celia will mention blah blah blah. I will go and eat because I trust her. Then I ask my partner, Zavin, uh, bring me to China. Can you bring me to China? And she will say no because she doesn't like me. Yeah, so it doesn't matter at all. <laughs> so I'm trying to say this: word of mouth is the most powerful marketing in the world. So that is easy because it's offline, but online. We still have word of mouth. Do you realize that? Uh, you probably do not realize that before, but after I'm teaching you, you probably say, wow, I didn't know that. You know, sometimes when you read an article and sometimes you get like, for more information, click here. Uh, to know about this product, click here. To know more about services, click here. What you're actually telling Google is, hey, Google, there's somebody that is, you know, more expert than in that particular topic. Why not just click here? So that is what you want in SEO. You want to ask other people to link to you, link to you. Does, it, does that make sense? That's the uh, equivalent to the offline word of mouth on Google. It's equivalent and we call it backlinks because linking back to you. In short form, it's called backlink. In the proper term, link building, off-page SEO, you can Google it, you can learn because now I'm giving you the structure so you can go and learn on your own. Definitely, yeah, definitely. So only four parts that you need to know, all right? So uh, let me just show you my Google, yeah? So this is Google. So if let's say I'm typing something like, for example, um, best food to eat in Cebu. I mean, I'm 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 just thinking of Cebu now, right? Maybe I want to go back. Um, yeah, probably. Let's be going to a bigger keyword. Maybe Manila. Okay, if you observe, you can see my screen, right? I think yeah, you can see my screen. Good. If you observe, yeah. Uh, best food to eat in Manila or Filipino food, you can see on the right side here what to do in Manila. I can just zoom in a little bit for you. You have what I call a related keyword search. So my Google actually tells me the amount of people that are searching on a particular month uh, using all these keywords like best restaurants in Manila for fine dining, uh, best food trip in Manila. I'm, I'm sure you can see, right? If you cannot see, let me know. My teammate will, will, will explain to me. So here we go. So if you know how people are searching, then if you rank for this keyword, it is easy to do business because you match the desirability of the people. Simple. Instead of guessing whether search or whether there's no search or whether there's demand or no demand, you know, you can use this tool. And I'm going to share this tool with you, you know, so that you also get the uh, similar numbers, yeah, very, very similar numbers like what I do. Now, again, let me just give you a disclaimer. These numbers or this volume it's just an indication, it's not accurate. It's about, I would say, 70% accurate. Give and take, can be more, can be less, according to season. But it just gives you a better indication rather than you guessing. Yeah? So let me go back to my slides. All right. So you can use a tool called Uber Suggest, yeah, or Uber Suggest. Uber, Uber, it doesn't really matter as long as you use it. You can um, take the link here or take a print screen here so you can type in later. You, or you can Google it, they're the most easiest. Uber suggests Chrome extension. Uh, I don't have to teach you how to do this. You can do it on your own. Technically, you just install the Chrome extension, click add extension. Oh, by the way, you need to use a Chrome. Um, in China, they call it Chromey. Yeah? You know Chromey, right? C-H-R-O-M-E, the uh, browser. Just use it Chrome or Chromey, and you will get the numbers, um, you know, just like that. It is free. Uh, uh, the only drawback is, uh, 
they want you to pay for it but if you pay for it you get to use it more often but the free i think you probably get about three searches a day that's it but it's good enough for in the beginning yeah so that is what i want to share with you the, the first part yeah or keyword so again now seo if you if you want to master this yeah i've been doing it a lot of times and i've um, probably earned quite a good number of money you can i want to share with you the four ways you can earn number one is a rank and rank model rank and rank model sorry where you rank your website and for example if uh, a restaurant says that in manila hey you are ranked number one can i rent your website on a monthly basis that's where you make money because you can charge people a thousand ringgit 500 ringgit two thousand ringgit doesn't matter because in manila or in any country i mean i can i can target any countries i want i can target kenya i can target south africa i can target the whole wide world if i want because this is a skill that i have think about it but if the person don't want to pay me another company will pay me because there are probably thousands of companies in that area so that is what we call the local seo or rank and rent model does it make sense um another thing you can also earn from affiliate marketing again because everybody search on the first page of google that's it so if you rank there and um, just now i believe tom says that if you give him a business he gives you 20 percent. exactly the same thing remember when people search for google the third intention is because they want to buy things so if you want to sell anything whether it's product or services and you find these keywords and you rank on the top of google you will get a lot of money simply because you earn commission and that's what i do yeah i earn a lot of commission from a lot of businesses and services so that is the second business model you can do as long as you're able to rank on the top of google you can do a local seo or you can do affiliate marketing or you can do build and flip which is like monopoly game like real estate yeah but uh, the good thing about real estate i mean online real estate is simply because you can build a lot of sites you can rank a lot of sites and because you're making money from all these sites listen and the keyword is making money people will want to buy your websites like properties with a higher number does it make sense because if you're making 100 ringgit or sorry 100 usd you can probably flip we call it flip yeah i'll share this all in a short while to make more so that is something that income number three build and flip give me a minute i'll explain to you uh, how this can be done yeah and of course seo as a service um in malaysia uh, where i am uh, we do charge about 5,000 USD to 8,000 USD to rank for a company for a year and it's recurring income so it's a very good income to be made because if you can rank uh, it's good and I know and I know majority of us today are from Philippines right I just want to give you a simple truth today Philippines um, don't mind me saying this is a little bit beginner in SEO it is probably about three to five years back a little bit yeah from Malaysia which is a tremendous tremendous opportunity for all of you simply because if you master the skill today you will dominate the market because less competition less people learning the skill in the beginning less competition even in malaysia even in southeast asia i can say is baby booming yeah it, it is just a, a skill that people are just picking up and everybody listen to me carefully everybody here uses google name me someone who doesn't use google who uses internet yeah um I mean, based on that context, huh? because everybody who uses internet will use Google. Of course, some people will say, I prefer Bing, I prefer Yahoo, but then again, they still use Google, I'm sure. Yeah. So four major ways of earning. Let's go to the next one. So local SEO site, I'll go a little bit fast here. Rank the keywords, for example, any keywords that you want to rank, for example, web design in your city, web design or SEO service or Facebook advertisement or food or product in your city. You get leads, you sell those leads to people, companies will buy from you, and make sure if you want to do local SEO, do not go for products because products, small margin, go for services, high profit margin, they will give you commission. And I want to tell you upfront this any, any single businesses in the world, it doesn't matter whether I'm from here or you're from Philippines or you're from Kenya or you're from Canada or US, it doesn't matter where you are. Listen to me carefully any business in the world will give you a commission upon sales that's it so if you can control the sales and the leads of any single businesses you will be the highest marketer in demand compared to any other people in the industry i mean the first thing that everybody fires in a company is usually the engineers 
I'm sorry about that. Because that's it. And even though the salespeople are frowned upon, even though marketers are very lowly, yeah, in the in the in the business, but every single businesses needs sales. And these are the highest people that will never lose job if they can bring in sales. So focus on getting leads, focus on getting people that will buy from you. And then you can sell this website if you want on a monthly basis, rank it, rent it, or even flip it or sell. So that's local SEO. Affiliate marketing, same concept, rank the website, put the advertisement link, get leads, earn commission, scale it up. As long as you understand the whole concept, SEO is easy, takes a lot of work. Number three, build and flip. Rank for keywords, link for affiliate, earn commission, and then if you're making money from here, flip it. Okay, what do I mean by flip? Now, let's, for example, my business. In, in my country, I have a company in DMC, and I have ranked my keyword to the first page of Google. Uh, rank about probably 50 to 100 keywords. I lost count, yeah? On the first page of Google, probably most of them top three. And on a yearly basis, on a yearly basis, I make about, Give and take, yeah. I'm just give you a ballpark figure about 250,000 USD, yeah, on a monthly or yearly basis. So, this is one website that I build for my business that generates that income for myself. Now, if I were to sell this website where I don't want to do this business, people will buy because I can prove over the many, many years that 200, 300,000, whatever, 400,000 USD that I'm making on a, on a one website. It is a proven business. Companies will probably buy it at a million dollars because they can get back their recurring income in two years. So that is the fundamental of business flipping. Because if that website, even if your phone, even if anything yeah, that is making money, companies will be willing to buy at a higher level because they can recoup the investment in about two to three years. And that's amazingly powerful. So think about it. Your website as a property yeah, rather than, you know, just think of it just as a website. It can be a very good, powerful, money generating income. So here, right now, I'm going to give you one, you know, one example. Of course, this is a very extreme example, but I want just to show you the potential and say that, hey, the website looks like this. You can, you can Google it. Yeah, it's 10 bees. Uh, just Google it on your own. Yeah, and I'll just show you live. You can see the website, right? It's 10 bees. If you're a web designer or if you know WordPress to build this website, yeah, man, it's like... Just a moment. Oh, sorry, Siri was talking to me. Sorry about that. I mean, it's just a normal website, right? It's, it's just articles, it's just text. I click on it, it's just content. But I want to ask you, yeah? I mean, if anyone who knows how to build a WordPress, this will go like, man, it's so easy. It's like, easy, easy, yeah? But they earn money from uh, Amazon, yeah? They put advertisement here, people click. But the, the idea is they rank on the first page, yeah? They do SEO. So coming back to this slide, I just want to ask you a simple question, this website. Um, can you just type in in the chat room? I'm going to, I'm going to go in the chat now. I'm going to go in the chat. Guess how much is making a month? That website, um, maybe about one, two years ago, yeah? How much it was making in a month? Take a guess. That, that site that I just showed you, the exact site. If you think it's A, type in A. If you think it's B or C or D. Take a guess. I'm going to look at the chat for a short while. Let me just take this up. So some of you A, some of you B, some of you C, some of you don't know. It's fine. It doesn't matter. Now the answer is this. He was making uh, during that time. Yeah, it's about. I'll tell you later. Let me just give you one more one more guess. And guess after he make that amount of money, how much he actually sold his website. That website that you are seeing now is still live. Take a guess. You can type in E, F, G, or H here. Yeah? So without wasting time, yeah, because I know time is a factor and I want to teach you so many things, you just imagine, you could Google it and you can read about his study, his, his case study, how much did 10 be sold during that time on the fifth month, he was making about 80,000 in commissions. I'm not talking about sales, yeah. I'm talking about commissions, about 80,000 site. I mean, yeah, he did a lot of work. And when he flipped the website, when he sold the website, he sold it for half a million USD, which is 500,000 USD. Now, why am I teaching you this or sharing this to you? Because unlike DMC, we have partners, we have a company, we have many staff. So it's not fair if I compare Apple to Apple, right? But this guy is an inspiration even to me simply because during that time when he built this, he was a one 
man show. So a one man show earning this income is tremendous. Because a lot of people say, I make a million, I make two million. Yeah, 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 you make two million when you spend 300 million. But this guy, 10 beast, one man show, started to build, earn a commission, sold it, and this is a living proof that any one of us can do this like this. Of course, this is very extreme. It is like, you know, but I want to share with you the potential of human and SEO. Does that make sense? All right, let me go back to my slides here. So you got the answer, right? More than 80,000 a month and sold it for half a million USD. So if you want to know that how people sell or where people sell, one of it is Flippa. Let me just show it live to you. You can, go, you can Google on your own, but this is Flippa. This will share with you. And you can see roughly, roughly, you can see that uh, this is, uh, let me just explain to you, yeah? I'll just take one example. You can see like they're making a monetization. These are all sold websites. So you can see what kind of sites can make money today. Yeah? So you can see the net profit. If you can see my mouse, they are making about $1,000 only. But they can sell it for $20,000. That is about 20 times the value of a monthly. So they probably wait about $1,000 a month. You know, investor will buy for $20,000. About 20 months later, they will get back their money. Now you have to think, why do people rush? Why do people buy sites that makes money? Simply because it is already a proven concept. Now think about it. Think about it, yeah. If, if, you, if you have done investment, any investment, it doesn't matter, yeah. <coughs> How much time do you think that to get back your money? Maybe three years, five years is normal for investor. But on a website, it's the same thing. So if you can wait two to three years, you can get back the money. After you get back your money, this website will still make more money as it goes along because the traffic of the internet will go up, the population of the world will go up, and people will use Google more and more. It's, it's very common. So in COVID, a lot of businesses destroyed, wipe out. A lot of people make a lot of money. So you need to play the game where you are. So again, I'll show you another one. For example, like uh, 4,000 a month, so like 50,000. 200 small websites, so like 3,000. You see the pattern. Yeah? And you see, hey, if you really click on it, which I just clicked one randomly, you probably think that oh, this is 10 bees. Let's forget about 10 bees. But this is one that I just clicked. This one probably make about 8,000 or 10,000. I, I can't remember. These are normal sites that you and I can build. Yeah, it's just rank, right? I mean, building a website doesn't have to be that beautiful. A lot of content. So, when people write, read the content, it's normal. When I'm looking for information, I read the content. And when I read the content, like, say, for example, I, I want to lose weight. I've lost a lot of weight, just to let you know. But I want to lose weight. So, oh, green tea is good, correct? Oh, yeah, I read about it. Yeah, you're ranked number one. I click on it. I mean, people don't care whether you rank. People just click. They don't know SEO, right? They just click on Google and they say, hey, this is cool. Oh, oh, blah, blah, blah. They see this. Then they go to Amazon or you know eBay or whatever is it. Yeah, it doesn't matter. And they click buy. And that's it. You get a commission from it. Uh, I will not recommend Amazon right now because the commission is small. But it is a set and forget business model, which I like to do. Yeah, Because you need a system in life to keep track. Yeah? Um, not to trade. You understand? Time is the most precious. A lot of people say time is money. I don't agree to that. Because if time is money, all of us got 24 hours. How can one a person like um, Jeff Bezos from Amazon make billions and someone from the poorest man in the world, which I don't know who, who's struggling? Time is not money because everyone has 24 hours. What you want, it is the duplication of it. Where if I can get somebody else time, if I can get somebody else to, to do it for me, I pay money. There's a business, obviously. Or you can set up a business or a SEO, you know, where it can generate income for you. Now, to do this takes time. I mean, I'm not going to lie to you. It takes probably six months to a year to build and see a profitable website. Small money. Big money depends on how much effort you put. But it's a beautiful system because once you do it, how do you think I get all my businesses? I don't have salespeople in my company. Anyway, coming back to Flippa, yeah? So this is a place that you can see, observe. Um, Empire, Flippers, a little bit higher class than Flipper, where if you have a website that you want to sell in millions, this is the place you go. I don't want to Google, I mean, I don't want to show you live. You can take a print screen. I'm not going to share these slides with you. These are my slides. But you can take a print screen now, our photo. And, you know, Google it later when you're free. But now, listen to me. Focus on me. So, SEO as a service, again, yeah, like I said, in a lot of countries, especially Southeast Asia, 
SEO is a booming skill. Not many people do it. And you can charge premium for this. Yeah. So how do you do that? You can do services like I do that. I do services for company. People say, can you help me rank my keyword? Yeah, why not? I rank your keyword, I get paid. Yeah. I can do training. I do training in SEO. That's also one of my biggest income. Good for me. You can be a consultant to take a look at businesses, to take a look at other websites, how to rank for it. You can do that. Or you can do site recovery. Now, this is something that's very new, especially even in Southeast Asia country. A lot of businesses today, a lot of individuals today, high powerful ranking individuals come to me and say, Charles, can you remove my name from Google? Because when people type in my name, it's all negative. You understand? Because maybe when they're young, they, you know, I don't know what they do. They probably enter jail or they did something that they regret. But when they're young, that's probably 15, 16 years old. And then they grew old, or 40, 45, 50, like me, old, old, old yeah. Um, not that old, but old. Uh, and then when I look back, when people type in my name, all, all the negative SEO. You understand what I'm trying to say in Google? So that is where now, right now, I have a lot of uh, powerful people come and say, can you actually give me good things about Google? Because reputation management or site recovery is a wonderful new SEO skill, especially in Southeast Asia. In fact, in any countries, I think also it's the same thing. Yeah, And this skill is so powerful because in the two hands, with your mind, you can do anything. Of course, of course, don't use it for the bad things. Yeah, Like most sensor men in Cebu or Paranaki, that it's not so good to learn, but anyway, it's for fun. Yeah? But I just want to show to you what you can do in Google, SEO as a service. So um, some people, they build websites and they earn from advertisements. So you probably see advertisements like these two. Yeah? You can probably identify when you click the advertisement, you go to the top right, you'll see something like, you know, in a blue box, like, a, you know, Google, ads by Google. So this is what we call uh, income by Google or Google AdSense, where people click the advertisement, do they, they don't have to buy anything, you get paid. So one click, yeah, just a click can make you about what? 30 cents, 50 cents, a dollar, two dollars, even ten dollars a click. Yeah. So there's a lot, yeah, there's a lot everywhere. So now when you go Google, you will start observing all this advertisement. People make money from here, people make money from there, people make money from everywhere. Because those who know how to do SEO are making money. Those who don't know SEO will probably just have fun on Facebook. Right? I mean, sorry, on Google. Excuse me, yeah. But right now, what you can see are Amazing things, advertisement, placement, people click, people get paid. So some websites, they don't really, you know, you know, some websites full of advertisement and you so get irritated and you accidentally click on it. I don't suggest you build those kind of things. Those are not good websites. But if you really take care of this, you know, probably build a site, rank it, put good advertisement, people want to click and people want to buy. So this is confirmed, definitely unique, and you can make money on the internet. Now, let me just tell you why people fail. Yeah, now people fail simply because there are lacks of motivation. Dan Beast is one of the most amazing guys that I've ever noticed can do this. But many people lack motivation because they're working alone, because they're not accountable. Yeah, so just now earlier, the girl, the younger girl, yeah, I mean, she's quite old, so now it doesn't really matter. Um, she's my partner, and we are quite accountable to each other, so that is why we are quite successful. You need accountable partners, so in Freedom Submit, yeah. Uh, Celia is very young, just to let you know. She's only about 18 to 19. I'm not sure, yeah. I'm not sure, but it doesn't matter. And we are accountable to build something on the internet. So you need an accountable partner in any business. Yeah, this is why most people fail in SEO because they don't have an accountable partner. Most people don't have a system. They just do things for the sake of doing things. I think we've learned from Martin to have a system, to have accountability, to have automation. You need that. And most of the time, you're overwhelmed because there's so many things to do, so many things to just observe. There's no one to you know guide you or help you. And probably because SEO, I'm going to be upfront with you, it probably take a year to see the good money coming in. My website that I built for the company, probably the second year only I made. So there's 24 months of no income of the company or maybe small income, only to make the big income. So it takes years. So when people have that understanding, it shouldn't be a priority because today I need to put food on my table. So let me just upfront tell you, SEO is an investment, a good skill set, but it's not fast money. If you are struggling today and you need to pay your bills, do not invest in SEO. Do not bother in SEO. But when times are better, or you think that I can put a little bit of effort every two, three hours a day to build my websites, to learn about this, go ahead. It's a long-term skill, but if you ask me, and this is my opinion, and it's a very powerful opinion because I live by it, if you ask me any digital skill set, I would say top rank, it is SEO. Second rank is content marketing. 
two skill set which is very needed today yeah so strategic skills that i give you take a print screen learn how to do wordpress learn how to do seo skills find a niche find a topic a lot of people say i want to do a lot of things no find a small niche a small area is good enough like i rank in malaysia you can probably start in your city whatever keywords that you want to use you super suggest that i suggested to you build a website around it and make sure it's focused do not write about so many other things do not even worry about the keyword searches don't that's a basic beginner's mistake write a lot of content a lot of value to people you will get the money you will get the sales ah so how many content minimum 20 30 content if you can do that you will see the money coming in each keyword yeah each keyword that you saw this now write about 1000 words article write good content give good information that's where when google says huh you are writing good content for the people to read good a lot of people say put a keyword here put a keyword there put a keyword here all that bullshit non sorry all that nonsense just write for human and google will know and do the best because when you go to google today do you see any optimization or any structure no i mean a little bit well but most of the time most of the time is if you write good content for google and people like your content google will know what to give people do you understand so write a content for human you yeah? know this is modern when six to a year six months to a year you need you need to set expectation anyone that tells you that you can make a lot of money in seo within instantly ask them to prove to you even you know one more step better ask them to show can you show me your ranking on number one page challenge them you know why because technically i was thinking that not many people can do because if they can do they can show to you first page ranking if not don't even bother to teach you you know so when you learn whether it's on youtube or you know on google or whatever make sure these people don't talk about their money so much make sure these people show you proof they are ranked on the first page number one then you observe how they do their website that's good enough observing is a very powerful skill set i think so yeah so don't worry about and don't get impressed i tell you up front today whether it's me or my partner or whoever do not get impressed when they tell you how much they earn because it means shit. <laughs> i'm so sorry i'm so sorry yeah i'm so sorry i'm live it means nothing that is why you see a lot of us a lot of speakers i think all the speakers when it comes out all are hand-picked by celia and the team we do not go and talk much about how much we make or how much we can it's not about that it's about helping you so please 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 freedom summit speakers quality guaranteed but when you learn from other speakers make sure you do not get impressed by what they say but you get impressed by what they do does that make sense okay good so tweak optimize monetize it learn all this thing find google learn all this keyword because i already give to you flip it uh, so if you want to google like how to flip an seo site you know i'm giving you all the keywords so that you can learn on your own yeah I, of course in my 45 minutes or 40 minutes i can't do a lot of things yeah i mean i can't teach you everything but i want to teach you as much as i can so that's it so how to get started three skills learn wordpress learn seo learn content marketing these are the top three skills that i said it is good enough already um if you want to choose one skill yeah these are uh, one seo skill that is consists of three wordpress seo content marketing and my secret system i'm sorry system an accountable partner if no one chase you if no one follow up on you you will get distracted because there's so many other things to do rather than seo but it's a beautiful business it's a beautiful system that's what i want to tell you yeah so do it so again that's it that's the final line of my slide if you want to learn more about what i do i do have more videos uh you can join my youtube all you need to do is take your phone yeah take your phone um you know scan the qr code using your camera it will open up a youtube and join that's it yeah so just now that 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 you know i, I don't want to say her because she's just beside me the beautiful girl that you have seen zevin um and i our business partner so she's talk, talking about um alibaba but i'm talking about um seo yeah, we're just side by side yeah and of course celia who is also a um, freedom summit partner and she's all the way i don't know where she stay but it doesn't matter because if i know where she stays i will google it and i'll put it the most sensible in her city also and she gets upset yeah 
um, and things like that. Okay, so that's it from me. Uh, I will take some questions. Uh, Celia, handing it back to you. Thank you, thank you. That was really uh, a very insightful, you know, a talk regard. No. I was, uh, can you hear me? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So um, that was uh, an insightful talk about uh, SEO and how we can, you know, um, uh, you know, uh, step up our game uh, with uh, digital marketing. And, and SEO, um, you went here in the Philippines before and uh, really you got us, you know, um, hooked when you are talking about, you know, flipping websites and and uh, um, learning more about uh, digital marketing. So what is your plan now? What is your next step? Uh, can you give us the, uh, because you have been teaching, like for me, for example, I'm a traditional entrepreneur, and uh, what I did um, now, uh, what I did before, doesn't seem important so important anymore because everybody seems to be doing everything in the, uh, in the digital world. So I know that uh, we have to transition, that we have to also uh, try to upskill and learn more, you know, um, skill sets. So what is your plan? Uh, this coming, you know, uh, for the for the coming uh, months because of what happened uh, during the pandemic, and also uh, um, regarding SEO, how can we learn more about this? Okay, good question, Celia. Thank you for that. Just now, I mentioned all the steps. Um, maybe what I can do for you, Celia, just for you. I never share my slides to people, but I'm just going to share and give it to you. And for those who are registered today, you can uh, or we can actually send out the slides to everybody who's attended today so that they can go and Google step by step what is the information on the slides. Um, if, if, if they like that, if they want it, it's yours, it's yours, take it. Yeah, that's good, that's good. That's uh, that's something good that uh, you're going to give us a copy of the slides. And if um, can we can we connect with you? Is there a way that we can connect with you? Like uh, because last time uh, <laughs> uh, you were here for quite a short time only. So if this people tries to um, you know uh, uh, check if they have the, the skill or the the time to learn about these types of digital marketing techniques, uh, uh, where 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 will they you know connect with uh, the chart the fame the most handsome? <laughs> okay. Gregory. Uh, okay. Uh because of my facebook um, it's almost full please do not connect me on facebook but i'm using linkedin yeah so you can just type in charles gregory linkedin i can add as many as i want uh, so please please connect with me in linkedin and i'll be happy to answer any of your questions there uh, if you can please uh, i'm also very selective with people who add me on linkedin if you just can just type in fsg or freedom submit when you connect with me i will definitely add you as my friend and if you need any help, just ask and I will respond to that as I can. So that is something for you today, yeah? Definitely all for you, yeah.